Dr. Groshemal Animal Hospital, and today we are discussing spaying and neutering of your pets. Dr. Grosh, what is dog spaying and neutering? Dog spaying and neutering is removal of the reproductive organs of your pet. So there's a little bit different process between neutering and spaying, but the goal is the same between each. How does spaying and neutering impact the health and well-being of my pet? Spaying and neutering has a lot of benefits health-wise for your pet. In females, the greatest benefit is you're reducing the risk of developing mammary cancer as they get older, and pyometra or infection of the uterus, which is a life-threatening emergency if intact females develop that as they get older. How soon should I bring my pet in to see a veterinarian to get my dog spayed or neutered? Age of spaying and neutering really depends on the breed specifically and you know what we would recommend for your pet individually depends on that particular breed and the factors surrounding there's a lot of different risks going into age of spaying and you know benefits to waiting longer in certain breeds but shorter in other. I would say a general rule of thumb is no earlier than six to seven months of age in either a male or female dog. What are some possible conditions that can be helped by spaying or neutering? Like I mentioned earlier, for females, pyometra and mammary tumors, the risk of those can be greatly reduced by, or by spaying prior to the first heat cycle. And then for male dogs, I find neutered males are well-rounded pets. They have better temperament compared to intact dogs. I find yard marking is less of an issue. And the biggest health concern for intact neutered dogs that get older is it increases their risk for developing testicular cancer. How long will it take for my dog to recover from being spayed or neutered? Typically they go home that afternoon. We like to keep them well rested for two weeks. We would typically like the cone of shame just so they can't lift their incision and cause trauma while they're healing. We like to restrict exercise just so that incision and they can heal well from that surgery. And we recheck 14 days after surgery just to make sure that incision is healed. And if everything looks good then, they can resume normal activities. What care should I be prepared to provide at home while my dog is recovering from their spay or neuter surgery? So spaying and neutering here, they come in the morning, go home sometime in the evening. Typically after being under anesthesia, they tend to be a little bit more sleepy. They may show less interest in food that evening. Um, but the next morning they usually go back to normal activity and will go back to eating and you know be more like themselves as they recover. Thanks, Dr. Grosh. You're welcome.